How about everybody? Big Bruce here with another video for Big Bad Small Cars. Man, I messed up earlier. My video cut off on me and kind of screwed up. And I thought that I caught it in time, man, but I brought to my attention by my buddy Doug that uh, I forgot to show you a couple of the best cars that were in there, man. I mean, there was a lot of good stuff, but there was some that I was really stoked about. And uh, I didn't notice that I didn't get them in either one of the videos. So that's cool, man. This is going to be a little cracking slash uh, showing a few more of the cars here. Over the lighting's alright, it's a little dark in here. Harley 5 pack, man. This thing is absolutely awesome. I've been hunting this for a while. And he's nice enough to send me the car still in the package. And you know me, I usually crack my cars, but these right here are probably going to be good and safe. I don't think I'm going to be cracking these. These are absolutely awesome. Brother, I do apologize by not getting all the cars in the video. I need me a good camera. These are just sick, man. Absolutely love them. Got the Bronco. Little Ford F-150. Little panel. That panel is one of the ones that I do chase. A little Ford F-150. And then the little drag truck. Those things are sweet. And then this one right here, man, this was something that I was absolutely stoked about. I can't believe it didn't get in the video. This is uh, one of my big chase pieces that I do. And this is, a, this is a piece that I never thought I'd get my hands on. And it's absolutely beautiful. Hopefully my light don't wash it out too bad here. Check this bad boy out. Let's see if we can get to go in here where we won't wash it out. Larry's garage. Check those wheels out. This is the only only tea bucket I have that actually has real riders and stuff, man. And uh, he actually Doug sent me the first two of my Larry Larry garage cars. So that's awesome. Another one that we showed earlier, but I didn't really get to show off. I was outside, I didn't want to take a chance to drop them. This thing is sweet. Let's see if we can get the focus in here. 68 Ford Custom. Thing's pretty badass. One of the old race cars. But the hood opens up there. That thing's too cool. Another one that we opened up earlier but didn't get to show off. This thing's pretty cool. That's what you see there. 49 Custom Buick. Increasing champ. I love this car, man. I just love the old big body cars. Big fat asses on them. Like that. Front window. The little scoop looks cool. Engine detail in there. A little slant six. Or straight six, yeah. A little straight six. The thing's too cool, man. Love that car. McDonald's. This car is sweet. Hood comes off, shows off the engine. I'll make me a little hood prop for it to go on the side. Out of some needles and stuff, and I'll paint them up red or yellow to match the car. So the thing's absolutely awesome. Another racing champs. Brother, I do appreciate the hell out of those cars. Then we got the, the mystery bags. I thought about keeping them in the package, but I was like, you know what? It's cracking. It's 
one should be the Corvette. Yeah. Yeah, it's cool. This one right here should be the... That one right there. Check it out. I didn't catch it. There was little cards in there. Like little stickers. That thing's kind of neat, too. It's pretty awesome. And uh, another thing that you brought to my attention here, if I can get into the box here, sitting over here beside me. And I guess it's just because I'm tired and stuff, and I just didn't notice, man. And I do apologize, brother. I, uh, I should have paid closer attention. The, the boxes blew my mind so much that I didn't notice it. I hope I get them all out here. Y'all bear with me. But, uh, some of these cars were treasure hunts. And it completely passed me by. I don't know how I managed to let it pass me by, but it sure did. I'm still pretty new to the collecting game and stuff, and I just now get my hands on my first treasure hunts and everything. I've gotten a couple of uh, supers. But I did miss the flames, brother. I do apologize about that. I love the castings either way. But that just makes them even that much cooler. I think this might have been one, too. i got to bring it in the light here. Yeah, that is, too. My little girl had her first two little treasure hunts. I'll teach you what that is. That's a pretty cool little car. She'll dig that. Corvette's a treasure hunt. Brother, you outdid yourself with this box. Treasure hunt. Yeah, you probably think I'm a I'm a waterhead almost, man. <laughs> From what I understand, I think he was saying either this one or the other one was a little bit harder to find. I, uh, I never did see this bug out in the wild. She's going to absolutely dig this thing. Let's see if I can get to the rest of them here. Sorry guys, I'm working. There we go. Got some more of them out here. Treasure hunt. Yeah, I'm a blind idiot. <laughs> These are cool, man. I know to look for the TH and stuff. I, I almost forgot about the, the circle and the flames. But I was digging the, the box so much, man, that I really did just overlook. treasure and also so I know I definitely don't have that one so yeah let me show these bad boys off again a little bit closer this thing is too cool matter of fact let's go ahead and crack her on open Much better. Now we can see underneath the hood. I don't have any of this casting yet. 56 Merc. That thing is sweet. I need to give me some more holders. I'm not going to open up the 59 Caddy right now because I do not have a good display for these. Thing is absolutely sick. Love that flat black and blue. So we'll go and show these ones off to you while we're at it here. The hearse. 
Go ahead and crack him on open. I gotta give you some more display stuff up for the cars and some more holders. So I've been keeping a little bunch of stuff in the packages and so we'll do a big cracking videos here. I always love how it's got the casket inside. Thing's too cool. My bone shaker. We're not gonna open up him yet either. My bone shakers right now have outgrew their little container, so I can definitely show them off a little bit better this way. Show off these layers of garages one more time. He will be getting cracked too. Like I said, I'm running out of holder room, so I don't want to take a chance of getting scratched up or nothing, so I can get it in the holder. So he's going to stay inside the cardboard for a little while. I'll let him breathe eventually. We'll open that up on video. Slow riders are sick. The working suspension on it there. No detailed interior. That plush interior. Things cool. Bunch more to find. Muscle machines, man. Those details on those engines are just out of this world. They're old Ford road, hot rods and roadsters, so they're safe. They won't be getting cannibalized. A little Civic hatch. He's going to be coming out of that package, too. Might do a little something with him. Probably going to do a little wheel swap on him. I got some tuner wheels that look really good. And then the one that everybody's really digging here. Let's uh, carefully open this up here. We're not going to take it out of the package though. This one might just hang on the wall like this. We can see a little bit better that way. Spectre Flame hood open. See little hood pins there? Got some great detail on it. Things sweet. Doug, once again, brother, I appreciate it, man. And uh, like I said, sorry about that, man. I, I guess I worked too much, man. I, I, I just overlooked all the, the treasure hunt markers on all those things. Uh, an airhead moment there. But uh, I appreciate everybody watching, man. Do me a favor. Hit like, hit subscribe, man. You guys go check Doug out, man. He's an awesome guy. Uh, if you're a YouTuber, man, he's, you probably know who he is, man. He, uh, he's a pretty friendly guy. But uh, go check out my Instagram, man. I'll be uploading some pictures here later on and everything. And uh, hit me up and comment. Take it easy.